hello hello beautiful souls today is such a mystical day spending time in the ocean feeling that crashing waves watching the eagles soar and after an hour i am here in the midst of this beautiful forest being grateful for all the blessings that we have being grateful that i'm in this bodysuit experiencing joy blissful moments with mother earth sophia the goddess of wisdom and as we celebrate the solstice tomorrow i am preparing myself for the messages that i'm going to channel to these uh, beautiful souls that are being called in my presence and today I literally walk with Desiree I don't think I've uh, told the story about Desiree she's my fairy she's such a beautiful fairy she's a special fairy I only wear her when I'm going through this uh, beautiful Neptunian energy of the mystics so tomorrow the solstice the beautiful expansive planet of jupiter and saturn are in conjunction in aquarius this is the time of our evolution a huge shift a change of our consciousness on how we can sustain mother earth and how we can assist all beings to release any fear any um, egoic illusions so it is a huge motion that we are being supported the planet jupiter symbolizes expansion the blessings abundance expedition journey travel and with the saturn the saturn is our planet of karma this is the planet of capricorn which is about our walk of life our ambition our time here on earth this is the the karma or the dharma that if we haven't done what we are meant to be here to to share we are being kicked in the ass <laughs> it's a kicker ass saturn so in that sense the jupiter is highlighting our purpose so we are here with the compass it's like a your your divine blueprint your akashic records and that is important to be able to access your soul's journey so you can release anything that is not serving you for your highest good and it's so easy to say all these things but it's the choice that will shift you into a higher vibration so as we align to our higher selves the highest good of all beings and grounded in mother earth the message is unified consciousness in aquarius which is the radical shift it's a surprise it's a mystical energy that is uh, taking you into a dimension that is beyond your comprehension so today while i am here contemplating opening my inner ears to the silence to the breeze of air to the crashing waves of the ocean I am in awe of divine creation. It's just a wonderful, wonderful time. And I am bringing this and anchoring this to those people that 
are listening, that are resonating to the magical world, to the wonderful world that we have. When your veil is lifted, you have no separation. So I wanted to share this um, beautiful gifts of words that I had um, received. It's the winds of change. The waves of the ocean washes away all fear. There is nothing that can harm you. You are my beloved. These words were coming from the beloved. That is like uh, your eternal connection to the higher power beyond your linear time, your mundane life. The crashing waves, the rising sun melting my heart into broken pieces as they lift me into the horizon of nowhere. I drift like the driftwood washed away from the pool of sorrows, beckoning your touch, your smile, your smell, your presence. How I love thee, my beloved, to wallow in these tears from heaven. While here in this body suit, I feel your reach deep in my heart. Tears fall down like a river in the sky, crashing again, breaking once more till there is no more pain. In that eternal moment, when I dance in the heavens with your wings of love, my eternal, my eternal son. In joy at peace to know you are my guiding light here in the crashing waves of the ocean. So while I was um, tuning into this um, gift of words, the vibrations of the crashing waves, it literally was um, kind of crushing my heart into pieces where it was washing away and cleansing my sorrows from uh, my loss, my, um, my son, right? Theo, it's been three years and it just dawned on me that i haven't really finished the book that i started i started journaling my emotions and my experiences with theo and so this time i feel like it is time there is no other time just like what is happening in our collective we are being called to to stay still, be still in nature, to, to know that in the midst of things that are chaotic, that is um, beyond our, our control, there is uh, light. So tonight, tomorrow, prepare your soul, your body, your mind, your spirit, an intention for your personal growth and for the collective. 
that we will all be guided with the Mother Earth's sustenance, the nourishment of our spirit, our physical body, that all aspects of our being would be in alignment for the highest good of all. That we will have pure intention, integrity, to be open, to humbly serve what is in your plate. So wherever you are, you can bloom whatever work you're doing. This is the time to just really feel connected to each one of us and that there is no separation and that what you see with the eyes of love to shift your perception from fear to love that all is well all is provided that we are in this together so we can pray We thank you, Divine Creator, and Soph, for the limitless blessings that we receive. We are grateful for this sacred walk of life that we can see through chaos. We can see through any distraction and that we are always guided. We are always protected. And that we receive these blessings through your divine grace. And so it is. Thank you so much, beautiful souls, and happy solstice. We'll see you tomorrow.